Now, your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you. Hi, I'm Alan Campbell. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. A last minute move could keep Sears from having to liquidate the company. The company's chairman submitted a bid to buy the ailing retailer and keep it out of bankruptcy. The move coming after the announcement that Sears is closing 80 more stores, two in Michigan, including the location at 12 Oaks Mall in Novi and the other in Muskegon. The closures will leave nine remaining traditional Sears stores in Michigan, including two locations, one in Livonia, the other in Westland. Blue Cross Blue Shield of Michigan says nearly 15,000 customers may have had some of their private information leaked. The insurance company says they're not notifying people as a precaution and they have no evidence any personal data was compromised. Blue Cross says the people who may be affected have their Blue Cross Medicare Advantage health insurance plans. Officials say the information was on a laptop that was stolen. Friends and family had a memorial gathering for retired U.S. District Judge Barbara Hackett. She passed away Sunday morning at her home in Brighton. People paid their respects at St. Mary Magdalene Catholic Church in Brighton. A mass will be held Saturday at 10 a.m. with the family gathering before the service. Here's meteorologist Mike Taylor with a check of your 7 First Alert forecast. Mike. And just checking out that forecast for tonight, we go down to around 29 degrees. The winds are going to subside, but we still have that wind chill value. And for your weekend, a high of 35 on Saturday, Sunday 37. The 40s return briefly for Monday with a chance of rain and snow. But after that, we bring in 2019 with highs in the 30s and lows in the 20s. All right, sounds good, Mike. Thank you. And those are your headlines. Remember to go to WXYZ.com and our 7 app for news anytime. Have a great day. These have been your latest headlines and seven first alert forecast from 7 Action News. Sponsored by Henry Ford Health System. All for you.